It's Lori Harvey. <laughs> hey guys, my name is Lori Harvey. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? My name is Muna. I hope you're doing well. What's my intro again? Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Muna and I hope you're doing well. So today I wanted to do something not with natural hair. As you can see, I have braids on. So I'm not going to be doing hair videos today. But however, I want to do a makeup video today. So today's video is going to be like an imitation video yeah but today i want to imitate Lori harvey's makeup so she did a video recently i think with let me check she did a video with allure and she was telling us her makeup routine her makeup steps and hacks are you joking so she was telling us her routine and hacks and you know the things here and there to do like how she does her makeup and for the longest time i've wondered how or how we did her makeup and when she showed us on camera i was like huh so this is what you always do hmm. so i wanted to just imitate it because i'm a huge fan and i love laurie harvey obviously she's beautiful i think her skin is amazing and i think she always looks clean at the same time she doesn't look too she doesn't look like she tried too hard you know what i mean but i've always loved her makeup so i just wanted to imitate it and do that today so if you're interested in that please keep on watching <music> I'm going to play her video on my phone and yeah we're just going to do it step by step and see how it turns out on my skin yeah. today we are doing a 90s soft everyday glam we might do a little bold lip so we'll see so today we're going to be starting with my skin by lh eye cream this is my peptide eye complex and i like to just apply it right up under my eyes just to give a little bit of brightness and so it really grabs and holds my concealer and keeps it in place it helps it not crease so this is an essential prep step for me next i'm gonna go in with my neocetamine cream this just really helps give me like the perfect base and it keeps my skin nice and hydrated and it keeps my makeup in place all day don't forget the neck. You gotta always go upwards with the motions because we don't wanna drag our faces down. We wanna keep everything nice and tight. And we're gonna use Pat McGrath's Sublime Foundation. That's what it's called. Yep, Sublime Perfection Skin Fetish Foundation. It is so good. I love it because it's nice and glowy. It has a good coverage, but it's not too, too heavy. We're just gonna put that. It literally goes on like butter. So good. So next, we're gonna go in with this Westman Atelier Contour Stick, which is also so pretty. I love them because they're all about clean makeup. And this, I love the way it blends into my skin. It's like she snatched, but it's like a natural snatch. So next, I'm gonna go in with my NARS concealers. I like to use two different ones. So I'll use this one, which is like a little bit darker. I'll use it here. I'll go on the chin. I'll do like on the corners of my mouth. And then I'll do a little strip. So, so far we are at the contour place and I like where this is going. My makeup would not come out like this. I think what helped was the eye. We haven't gone into the eye cream. But I, I think what has been helping is the moisturizer and the moisturizer application so right now we are contouring and i don't really contour so i'm kind of excited to do this anyway so she didn't really say too much about the contour but i like where this is heading yeah so basically she's doing like a simple makeup and she said to blend the contour and that's what we're gonna do or that's what we're doing basically so yeah i think we're done did it really snatch my face not really not really but i guess we're just going for like a natural makeup so i'm not mad i'm not mad at all so far i'm not mad i won't been doing but let's continue all right so she said she's using two concealers one dark one and one light one first of all my concealers are not nars so they are different concealers and they are not nars so one is from fenty and one is by clinique but granted they are different 
colors like she sorry there are different colors like she stated that she's using so that's what i'm gonna do okay <laughs> we are imitating lori harvey so let's see where this is going i'm my nose and i'll kind of go like three little layers there and then i'll go right here and here and i'll just do a little bit here because my rosacea likes to flare up sometimes so just so she doesn't get too red during the day right there and then i take the lighter one and i put it literally right in the middle and that just kind of gives my eye like a little pop of brightness so now we blend so I like to wet my beauty blender with like warm water because I feel like that just really helps to melt the product into my face. Because I like to have a really natural, smooth looking base. And then we just kind of melt everything in together. See how that little bit of concealer right there really just like adds to the snatch. And then having the concealer kind of like right on the outer corners and then blending it up, it kind of just lifts it up. Okay, she's blended in. She's melted in. Here's where it gets fun. So I like to mix two cream blushes, which these are the Merit Blush Bloms, which I love these because they feel so smooth and soft going on the skin and they just blend so good. Put them on like that in like an upper motion. And then, I'll <laughs> and then I take it and I kind of go across my nose a little bit. I like to just look like kind of flush and then I put a little bit on my chin and a little bit on my forehead. And then I go in with the darker one on top. All right, so um, basically I'm concealing or I am blending the concealer like Miss Harvey said we should do. And well, granted this is like my regular makeup but she is throwing in some hacks that are actually working and I can actually see how better my makeup is <laughs> you know i'm not used to this but i can i understand what's going on here and i get why i get why her makeup is always snatched so you know what she said about the eye going whoo focus all right you know what she said about the eye going whoo yeah i got that she's actually quite right so yeah Ooh. And this is quite easy for me because already, like I said before, this is like my kind of makeup, if that makes any sense. So yeah, I think I'm going to adapt this routine into my own or mix it into my own routine because I like what's going on with the concealer. Okay, so let's continue. So my bad, I thought that she didn't blend her concealer for some reason. I don't know why I thought that, but so far so good. We're doing well and I like that. She mentioned getting like a Fenty Beauty bronzer. I personally don't have a bronzer. I don't know why I don't have a bronzer. But I do have ooh, a compact Maybelline powder that, you know, I lost the brush or I lost the puff. But it can serve as a bronzer because, well, it's really darker than me and it sort of has that bronzy feeling without being a bronzer you know what they say about makeup as long as it works just use it so she tapped this a little and just like powdered right here so that's what we're doing all right hmm I love where this is going so she just nothing to and then i'll take the excess because i don't really know how to contour my nose so i'll kind of take whatever the excess is on the brush and i'll kind of just go along the side of my nose like that right up under and that is my line. Bring it down to the nose. Everything is nice and warm. Give a chill. And then I go on top of this. Sorry, guys. So I'm skipping the brows. Just because I know that I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'm not going to be able to do that. And I need to learn that off camera. And two, I think I already got something done on my brows. I literally just filled it up, nothing too wild. But I'm gonna do the under eye thing or under brow thing she did at the end of this video. 
as you will see later on but i'm not doing the brows i'm gonna skip that and we're gonna go into the next one i think she said to get like a quad so she had like a like a what's it called like an eyeshadow ish thing i'm not too sure about the color that she used but i have a couple so i have this this is from zaron i have this yeah but most of this is liquid is uh a little it's not it's not powdery it's just one of it that's powdery it's just this that's powdery so i don't think that would work but i also have this that i stole from my sister and it's still here so i think this should do but this doesn't shine like hers so i don't know so on another note i think this would work so i think this would work although she did something like this but it was a little glittery so and i don't have anything wait hold on i have something i knew i had something yeah i do have her so this is what i'm gonna use here so she took that and just oh sorry i'm just gonna use my hand she just used that and just went here like this oh that's pretty why haven't i used this before what miss harvey is onto something so i'm gonna go in with this color just tap the excess off and then i just like Tap it along my eyelids like this. Wow, that's really pretty. And she took something a little bit darker and I think she mixed it and then just went above her eyelid for like a crease. You know, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. And then I just like to go right up under this. on my bottom yeah. lash line to just give a little bit more definition. I think this brush, and I know it's a blending brush. Tell me if I'm doing that well. Okay, I look crazy. Oh, that's a lot of glitter. I didn't want to see that. Okay. So she did this. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, that's a lot of glitter. I have to clean a lot of these later, but whatever. <laughs> so, um, and I'm gonna use an eye pencil to just do what she did here. I really don't know what I'm doing with my eye, but well, it's fair because I really don't always know what I do with my eyes. Yeah. So for mascara, yeah, use that to lift the eyes. I don't think she did any half with Really trying so. to do no lift. lashes right now. I don't fix lashes too as well, so I think we're sisters, Lori Harvey. I think we're sisters. My camera is about to die. Ooh, that looks good. All right. So I'm just going to use my brow pencil. She used the lip pencil, then use the brow pencil. So I'm just gonna line my lips like this, and then I go like up the center like that, and then I come down. And then going with a fancy gloss balm. Hmm. Well, I didn't do the same thing she did for her lips, but I think this works. So she also said to spray this with a setting spray. So this is a setting spray I have from Airbrush Beauty Setting Spray. I use this one all the time. Well, I'm going to work, so I'm not going to use the other spray. I do have that, but I'm not going to use it today because it leaves my face looking cakey. And I don't have Lori Harvey's expensive products, so. And then I take my yeah, beauty blender. So I'm just gonna use the beauty blender, as she said. Blend so it all in. And, and this is the final done. look. A nice 90s bronzy soft glam. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a huge thumbs up if you like videos like this. And please make sure to subscribe and leave a comment down in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next week Sunday. Bye. <laughs>